All right, guys, so we're going to get a little bit nerdy today. We're going to uh, go through basically uh, the differences in these cranks and uh, how, you, how do you tell the difference between them. Um, so obviously what we got here is a 5.3 liter crank. You guys know that by now if you've been watching my videos. So it's a third gen, and third gen runs from 1999 to 2007. And all third gens, no matter what size of engine they are, all have a 24x reluctor wheel on them. This crank here, even though it's a 5.3, it's going to have the similar casting number. There's the casting number there. So it's 12552216. So that's going to have a similar casting number to the LS1 5.7 liter crank. However, the LS1 crank has, a, has gun drilled mains on it. And if you don't know what gun drilled mains means, it means basically a straight, like a straight drill through the crank on the mains. So like you'll have like a hole right here, or sorry, uh, right here, I should say on the, between the main or on, on the mains, I should say. Yeah. So it'd be a hole there, even like right through on every main. That's what gun drill means. Um, so I'll post some pictures at the end of this video and I'll give you, uh, examples of that. Um, what else do I want to say here? Um, so half the time when you're, when you're dealing with a smaller LS motor, uh, like especially specifically the truck ones, it's, it's hard to tell the difference because GM, you know, they did like a really cruel joke <laughs> to people by labeling the blocks 4.8 slash 5.3. So essentially you can't tell the difference, but just by looking at it, not until you, uh, you dig further into the motor, but obviously like the real difference is like the stroke in the crank. But yeah, so the stroke for the 5.3 crank is 3.622 and the stroke for the 4.8 is 3.268. But, uh, mm. you know, just by looking at them side by side, you're not going to still be able to tell the difference. So you get, you pretty much got to go by the casting numbers on them. So. Obviously the 5.3 is 12552262216 and the 4.8 it'll be uh be 12553482. I'll post a lot of these numbers and stuff at the end of the video. Okay, so the other thing uh, I want to go back to talking about gun drilling. Uh it's like a racing term uh but it's supposed to by doing that it uh, lightens the crank and it's supposed to create better integrity for overall for the crank even though in a sense that you know, you wouldn't think that would make sense by drilling holes you would think it would kind of distort distort that but uh well, from what i've been reading it's supposed to it's like a they use it a lot in drag racing and stuff like that and uh gm obviously has done their ls1 they gun drilled the crank. I don't know about the newer motors or not. I have to get up to speed on that stuff. Like I'm still learning a lot of this stuff right now myself. So yeah, I've been doing a lot of reading lately, but, uh, but yeah, that's the term for gun drilling or like what it means anyway, to lighten up and, uh, uh, like boost overall integrity of the crank. So that's that anyway, I think I pretty well got everything covered. What I wanted to say about the crank. And, uh, yeah, we'll get into all the other parts later on. All right, guys. Thanks a lot for watching and cheers.